In this video, I'm going to show you how the administrator can place an order on behalf of the customer. For example, your customer does not have internet access, and the only way he can place an order is to call you up. So you need to have a way to put the order through the system for the customer. So the way you would do it is you log in as an administrator, and you see the box here called admin order all you need to do is type the username of the person that you want to place an order for for example the post payment account click go and now you see you are logged in as the post paid one account in this mode you will be able to see everything on this user's account as if you log in using his username and password but by using this admin order function, you do not need to know or change the password for this account. If we go to my parcels, you will be able to see all the parcels that this account has ordered in the past. Now as the administrator, in order for you to place an order on behalf of this user account, all you need to do is go to a quote and book page. Enter the pickup address, dimension, weight, and destination address as you normally would. And complete the checkout process as usual. Once you have finished the checkout process to place an order for this customer, you need to go back to the administrator account. To do that, all you need to do is click this switch back button inside this admin block and you go back to your administrator account. You may have a few customers who always call you up to place an order because they don't have a computer. What you can do is you can create a shortcut so you can quickly switch to their accounts. What you need to do is go to Knife Puzzles, scroll down, click Admin Order, scroll down. In this field, type in the account name of the user you want to create a shortcut for. Click Save Configuration. If we go back down, you will see it says Admin Order Block. This means the shortcut will be created in the admin order block. Now let's go back to see how it looks like. Close this. You see this quick switch button? You click it, you will be switched to postpaid one account. Now let's go back. Puzzles, admin order. There's another shortcut here. This view here will create a shortcut in the navigation menu for the username you type into this box. By default, the navigation menu is disabled, so I need to enable it now so we can see how it looks like navigation menu we'll put it on the sidebar go home the navigation menu this is a shortcut we have created for the postpaid one account now you may be thinking i have created an order for my customer but if they don't have a computer, how would they be able to print the shipping label? The way we would recommend you to do is you get your driver to print this out and bring it to the customer when you pick up the parcel. So you can stick it on a box and your driver have a way to scan the QR code. Otherwise, if your customer do have a computer and printer, but they don't know how to use your website, you can save the shipping label as a PDF document and email it to them and ask them to print it and stick it on the box. This is one way you can save the shipping label. 
you log in back as the customer go to my puzzles let's say this is the one I want to print press print label scroll down press the print button if you are using Chrome browser you can save this as a PDF document see save it and send it